In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NHL games happening on January 3, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NHL games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Calgary Flames vs. Winnipeg Jets The Calgary Flames came into 2022 with massive expectations on their shoulders, and while it's taken some time for their new pieces to blend together, they look like a team building to something big in recent times, and now they've got a big task ahead of them as they travel east to take on the Winnipeg Jets in a rematch of a thrilling 3-2 contest back in November. These two teams are currently sitting in playoff spots in their division, but with little margin for error, it makes every game going forward crucial to playoff standings at the end of the season season, and with two squads that know each other so well, this should be one of the best games in the NHL all week long. Calgary is 4-1 in their last five road games and 5-2 in their last seven games. The under is 4-0 in Calgary's last four games. Winnipeg is 9-3 in their last 12 Tuesday games and 17-6 in their last 23 home games. The under is 19-7-1 in Winnipeg's last 27 home games. The under is 11-3 in these two teams' last 14 head-to-head -head meetings in Winnipeg. Winnipeg is playing well at both ends of the ice as the Jets are scoring an average of 3.03 goals per game and allowing an average of just 2.57 goals per game. Winnipeg's Connor Hellebike has been in net in 28 of the Jets' 37 games this season and has a 2.5. 32 goals against average and .928 save percentage. Calgary has lost 9 of its last 13 when playing against an opponent that has a winning record. Winnipeg has won 17 of its last 23 games played on its home ice and the Jets play well against Calgary at home, winning 4 of the last 5 meetings in that situation. Calgary is surrendering close to half a goal more per game than Winnipeg at 2.95 goals per game and is scoring only slightly more at 3.03 goals per game but faces a tough Winnipeg blue line and goal Despite the loss the last time these two met in Calgary, the Jets have been fairly dominant in this rivalry, and with a 4-1 record in their past five games in Winnipeg, they should come into this one loose and full of confidence. All over the ice, the matchups in this one will be fantastic to watch, with Markstrom versus Hellebuyuk the key attraction, and while it will be a close game, the underdog Jets will take care of business, so the Winnipeg Jets' money line is our full game side pick. For both of these teams, success comes with their goaltending, and that includes head-to-head -head matchups, as the under is 11-3 in the past 14 meetings in Winnipeg, with a 21-8-1 mark in their past 30 games overall. For the Calgary Flames, the under is 4-0 in their past four games, in which they've posted a 3-1 record. And for the Jets, the under has tallied a 19-7-1 mark in their past 27 games at home. So while this game should be full of quality all over the ice, under the projected total is our full game total pick. Montreal Canadiens vs. Nashville Predators The Montreal Canadiens conclude a seven-game road trip on Tuesday when paying a visit to the land of the Grand Ole Opry to play against the Nashville Predators. Montreal was defeated by the Washington Capitals 9-2 on Saturday and the Canadiens have lost five straight. Montreal is 1-5 on its road trip. Nashville was defeated by Vegas 5-4 in overtime on Friday and the Predators have lost three of their most recent four. Paul Byron, Emil Heineman, Mike Matheson, Sean Monaghan, Carey Price and David Savard are out for Montreal. Mark Borowiecki and Michael McCarron are out for Nashville, while Cole Smith is questionable. The Canadians are 19-46 in their last 65 road games and 38-86 in their last 124 overall. The Predators are 1-4 in their last five home games and 3-9 in their last 12 overall. The under is 7-3-2 to to two in Canadians last 12 overall. The under is 4-1 to one in Predators last 5 Tuesday games. The Canadians are 1-5 in the last 6 meetings in Nashville and 1-6 in the last 7 meetings. The favorite is 10-3 in the last 13 meetings. Not only have the Canadians struggled to keep anyone out of their own net as of late, they've struggled mightily in this head-to-head -head rivalry over the past few years, and after losses of 4-1, to 7-2, to and 9-2 to in their past 3 games on the road, this is a very 
tough way to wrap up a road trip before they head back to Montreal. The Nashville Predators are the better team no matter how you slice it, and they have an even bigger edge at home. The Montreal Canadiens can't get out of their own way, and they've been even worse on the road. If the Predators are going to turn this season around, these are the games they need to take advantage of. In the last seven meetings between these two teams, the Predators have come away with six wins, as well as holding a dominant 5-1 to one mark in their past six meetings in Nashville. So with all that plus the defensive struggles working against Montreal, the Nashville Predators will take care of business in this one. So the Nashville Predators' money line is our full game side pick. While the highlight of both these teams is the offense, the under is a surprisingly good move in this one, as these two teams have played some low-scoring contests as of late, with a 13-5-1 mark in their past 19 head-to-head -head clashes. For Montreal, the under is 8-3 in their last 11 games against teams with a losing record, and for the Nashville Predators, the under is 7-3 in their last 10 contests against the Eastern Conference, so while there's been plenty of highlights with these teams as of late, the scoring struggles will come back to haunt them in this one. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Tampa Bay Lightning vs. Chicago Blackhawks The Tampa Bay Lightning, the defending three-time Eastern Conference champions, travel to Chicago to face off against the Blackhawks in this cross-conference matchup for the first time this season. The Bolts are 23-11-1 on the season while the Hawks are 8-24-4. The Lightning are 3-7 in their last 10 Tuesday games and 20-8 in their last 28 overall. The Blackhawks are 14-37 in their last 51 home games and 12-41 in their last 53 overall. The under is 3 to 1 to 1 in Lightning last 5 road games. The over is 4 to 0 in Blackhawks last 4 home games. The Lightning are 8 to 1 in the last 9 meetings in Chicago and 25 to 8 in the last 33 meetings. The favorite is 22 to 6 in the last 28 meetings. The Lightning are the far superior team in every facet of this matchup. Tampa's offense is elite this season and they should have no issues pouring it on against a very weak Chicago defense and a weak goaltender in Petter M. Razik. Additionally, the Blackhawks offense has been able to generate the fewest goals in the NHL this season, and a team with the caliber of the Tampa Bay Lightning will be able to shut them down. The Bolts have won their last six straight matchups and have covered the minus 1.5 puck line in every one of those games, along with winning nine of their last ten matchups. The Tampa Bay Lightning are looking more and more like the team we see every year, and they rarely lose to teams they should beat when they're in this form. The Chicago Blackhawks continue to pile up the losses, and they're dead last in terms of money earned this season. No team has hurt betters more this season than the Blackhawks. The Blackhawks are extremely overmatched in this game, so the Tampa Bay Lightning to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Both teams have trended over. I expect a lot of goals here with the Lightning's very good offense capitalizing easily on a very weak Blackhawks defense and one of the worst goaltenders in the NHL this season. Both of the goaltenders in this game have a sub-0.900 save percentage and a higher than three goals against average this season. Along with the Bolts likely scoring at ease, I expect Brian Elliott to also give up a handful of goals to the Blackhawks. I also expect a lot of goals in this game, which has hit easily in the last three straight games between these teams. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.